Have you ever just been watching a video, you know, minding your own business, watching a video, and then all of a sudden the screen pops up with this static and it makes this really loud, high-pitched static noise? Well, in this video, I'm going to show you how to make a TV static effect inside of Sony Vegas. Okay, so to make the TV static effect, you're going to first need to have two programs installed on your computer. So obviously you're going to need Sony Vegas installed, and you're also going to need a free program called Audacity, which is to create the sound. So anyway, I'm going to be using Sony Vegas Movie Studio Platinum 8.0, but this will work in pretty much any version of Sony Vegas that has MIDI generator. So Sony Vegas 8, Sony Vegas 9, any version of Sony Vegas that you have, that'll work, but I'm going to be demonstrating this in Sony Vegas Movie Studio Platinum 8. And then you're going to need Audacity, which is to go ahead and generate the noise but we're gonna go ahead and save that part for later and so anyway so first to go ahead and generate our TV static background what we're gonna do is we're gonna open up Sony Vegas and we're gonna go scroll down here to the media generators tab click on that and then scroll over to noise texture and then go down and see something that here that says starry sky you want to take starry sky starry sky and drag it into your timeline right here and then it should come up with the options right here so here under minimum we want to take the minimum we want to drag it to around here drag it to around that. And also, if I forgot to tell you, you want to make your color white. So change the color to around white, which you see here I've changed my color to uh, white up there. And so then what you want to do is you want to keep the amplitude and grain right around here, which will basically uh, just don't really screw around with those options. Uh, here on the uh, bias, if you want to leave it around here or keep it around zero or around negative point sixty and here in progress and degrees is the uh, really important part we're, what we're gonna do is we're gonna keep the video started at point zero on the progress and degrees but we want to go down here to the uh, noise texture timeline down here. You want to click on the end of the timeline, so right around here, and then go here and add in a new keyframe. So insert a new keyframe there, and then while you're still on the new keyframe, drag the progress up to 10%, or drag it up all the way. Then just close out of the window, and if we go ahead and preview what we've got, as you notice, it is moving. And so anyway, now that we have our uh, texture loop moving, now we, all we need to do is add in the sound. So in order to get the TV sound effects, what we want to do is open up Audacity. And once we have Audacity open, go up here to Generate, and then go down here to White Noise. Make the length in seconds the length at which you have your clip right here. So our clip right here is around, uh, whoops. Our clip right here is around 10 seconds. So what we want to do is we want to generate a 10 second time clip. So here under the generate noise, we want to go ahead and just type in 10 for 10 seconds and then click on generate noise. And if we click on play there, it should play with the uh, static sound. So once you have that done, just go up here to file and then export it. And then you should have something with the uh, wave file right here. I already have the file right here, which I've named white noise. So anyway, once you do that, then all you want to do is you want to go ahead and import it into the timeline. So I'm going to go ahead and click and drag my white noise into the voiceover box and then if we go ahead and play the whole video from the start it will have the static effect so if I go ahead and play the video now as you notice it has that static effect in it and so anyway that is how you go ahead and create a static uh, or TV static effect inside of Sony Vegas thanks a lot for watching guys and I'll see you guys in the next video